group of Breton Education Center grads are distraught after being characterized as vandals. On June 11th, 20 to 30 students celebrated what they say is a tradition and ended the year prank at their school. We did like an hour's worth of pranking. Um, it was cleaned up all by 10. All we did was use washable markers, streamers, move some desks around, uh, some silly string, and that was pretty much it. Some paper towel here and there, you know, that was it though. Saying it was sanctioned by administration, the students were let into the school early and prepared for the arrival of teachers by doing everything from rolling paper towel down hallways to decorating walls with balloons and streamers, but say they did not cause any vandalism. We didn't mean to cause any harm. We're just the grads at the end of the year trying to have fun. Later that morning on prank day, the teachers retaliated calling them outside early for their school graduation class photo and sprayed them with water guns. After losing their grad year to the pandemic, their prom and more, the students say now being called vandals in the June 14th story in the Cape Breton Post is taking away another tradition for them. So I was having permission to go into the school and do our grad prank. Our, our story was posted online, but it wasn't our side. And we did get a lot of negative comments and it, and it made us feel so down. And it kind of took away from our positive, like, end-of-the-year prank that we needed for the end of the year because everything was taken away from us due to COVID. In New Waterford, Sharon Montgomery-Dupe for Saltwire Network.